Good day to everyone. I'm Teacher Raymond from Don Ramon E. Costales Memorial National High School. And for today, I'm going to teach you how to create your video lesson using the CapCut application. Teachers, are you ready? Let's begin. Before we continue, let us discuss first about CapCut. What is CapCut? CapCut is a free all-in-one video editing app with everything you need to create stunning and high-quality videos. Using this app, we can easily trim, reverse, and change the speed of our video with an easy-to-use editing feature that helps you record and create your video lessons. Here is a sample video lesson made using the CapCut app. Please watch and observe. Hello students! How are you today? This is Teacher Catherine Sakino, your physical education teacher. Are you ready to learn today? Clap your hands three times if you are ready. Good! Before we begin our lesson, let me show you the most essential learning competencies. First, undertakes physical activity and physical fitness assessments. And second, executes the skills involved in the dance. For you to be guided on what you are going to learn today, bear in mind that you are expected to do the following. 1. Identify and discuss the different locomotor and non-locomotor movements. 2. Execute the basic folk dance steps in 2-4 times signature. And number 3. Appreciate the value of the basic movements in executing festival dances. Now, I want you to get your notebook or paper ball pen, and your PE module so you can follow our discussion and answer some of our activities. Now, let's go to the basic procedures on how to create video lessons using the CapCut application. Note, if you can't follow the instructions given in my presentation, don't worry as you can still watch this video tutorial using this link. Open the CapCut app. Click New Project. Click Photos. Select a photo as your background. Click the photo and then click Add. To add a second video layer, click Overlay. Click Add Overlay. Click Videos. Select your video introduction. Click the video and click Add. Use both fingers to resize your video. Click Edit. Click Crop. Crop the video. Click the check icon. To remove the background of the video, click the chroma key. Drag the color picker to the green background. Click shadow and adjust it to 100. Click the intensity and adjust it until the green background is removed. Click 
click the check icon. Stretch the background picture by dragging the image tip to the right. Play your video to check the unwanted scene. Hello students! How are you today? To split a video, put the vertical white line at the position you wish to split. Click Split. Click the unwanted video scene and press delete. Click the video and drag it to its proper place. Play the video to know where to put the name of the teacher. Hello students! How are you today? This is teacher Katrin Sakino. Your physical education teacher. Position the white vertical line where you will place the name of the teacher. How are you today? This is teacher Catherine. This is teacher. Click the back arrow. Click text. Click text template. Select News and choose any text template that you want. Drag the text template to your desired place. Resize the text template by dragging the square icon at the bottom right corner of the text. Click the News text box to edit the text. Click the check icon. Repeat the same procedure to the other text box. Play the video to check the text template. Hello students! How are you today? This is Teacher Katrin Sakino, your physical education teacher. Are you... Hello students! How are you today? This is Teacher Katrin Sakino, your physical education teacher. To insert a transition, you have to split first the picture background and video. Place the white vertical line to the area where you want to split the picture and video and then click split. Your physical education teacher. Are you 
ready to learn today! To add the transition, click the white square with vertical line in the picture. Select any transition design that you want. In my case, I selected the right arrow and changed the duration to 1.0. To change the angle of your video, resize it using both fingers and then drag the video to your desired place. Play the video to check the transition and video angle. To add a sound effect, place the white vertical line in the transition box icon and click Audio. Click Effects. Select the sound effect that you want. Click the sound effect to hear the sound. If the sound effect that you have selected is not available, choose another one. Click this button to import the sound effect. Adjust the sound effect to match transition. To add text, click the back arrow twice. Click text, click add text, type the information in the text box. Select the font style of your text. Resize your text. Play the video to check your text. To add text animation, click the text and then click animation. Choose any animation design that you want and adjust the duration to 1.4 seconds. Play the video to check the text animation. Education teacher. Click the back arrow twice. To add another angle, split the video. Drag your video to another position and resize it to your desired format. Play the video to check the new angle. If you are ready. Good! Before we begin our lesson, let me show you the most essential learning competencies. Cut the unwanted scene in the last part of the video and background picture using split. Click delete to remove the unwanted scenes. To 
add another video, click the white square with plus sign icon. Select your second video. Click Add. Play the video to check the imported video. To adjust the volume of the video, click the video first and then click the volume icon. You may adjust the volume from 0 to 1000. Play the video to check the volume level. Click the check icon. Click the second video. Click edit. Click crop. Crop the video. Click the check icon. Click the back arrow. To remove the background of the video, you can also use the remove background by clicking it. Wait for the remove background to finish. Click the back arrow. Another way to add a background picture to your video is through Canvas. Click Canvas. Click Background. Choose any background design that you want. Click the check icon. Click the back arrow. Click the second video. Resize the video and drag it to your desired place. Play the video to check the angle and unwanted scene in the second video. Position the white vertical line to the place where you will split the video. Click the second video and click split. Click the unwanted scene in the second video and then click delete. Play the second video to check the flow. Insert a transition between the two videos by clicking the white square button. Click MG. Click square wipe and adjust the duration to 1 second. Click the check icon. Play the video to check the angle and transition. Peace. First. 
this. Position the white vertical line between the two videos in white square box of transition. Click Audio. Click Effects. Select the sound effect that you want. Adjust the sound effect to match the transition. Click the back arrow twice. Click text. Click add text. Type the information in the text box. Click the check icon. Stretch the text layer by dragging the right side of the text until the video and the text have the same length. Add another layer of text by clicking the add text. Type the first milk of the lesson in the text box. Click the check icon. Drag the text layer and position it to your desired place. Resize the text box to fit in the monitor, then drag it again to position the text to your desired place. Stretch the text until the video and text have the same length. Play the video to check the text if there are errors to correct it at once. First, undertake physical activity and physical fitness assessments. To create a copy of the text box, click the text layer and then click Copy. Drag the text box for the second milk and position it to your desired place. Double click the text layer to edit the text box. Delete the previous text and type the second milk. Drag the text box to your desired place. Click the check icon. 
play the video to know when to appear on the screen the second bell. Click the text layer for the second melt. Click split. Click the unwanted scene and click delete. Play the video to check the flow of the text. Before exporting the video, you have to check the full video for Hello, possible students. errors. How are you today? This is Teacher Katrin Sakino. Once the video is free from errors, you can now export your video by clicking this icon. Wait to finish the exporting process of the video. Once the video is exported, you can now share or view the final video. That ends my presentation. Thank you for listening. Have a nice day!